Hi everybody, Floyd here. Uh, I've been seeing a lot of things on YouTube, uh, you know, about wind and flying your drone in the wind, and everybody wants to do their wind test and whatnot. But uh, and uh, yeah, be that as it may, I'm not, you know, people can fly whatever conditions they want to. But I have the UAV forecast uh, uh, app here, and uh, currently at my location here. Uh, uh, what's telling me it's not good to fly. You know, the wind speed is 13 mile per hour with gusts at 23 mile per hour. Now, that's what the app is telling me here. But there's something that I, you know, I just, particularly for, for, for newbies into the hobby, uh, if you download this app, you have to understand that when you download this app, uh, there are settings you can adjust to it. So, if we go into our settings here, and we go into threshold settings. Now I have my max wind setting at 20 mile per hour. I'll fly in 20 mile per hour winds depending on you know what gusts are and so on and so forth. But and then I uh, I I have the uh, forecast to include the gusts. But the important thing and what I want to get to here is the uh, wind altitude. Now by default when you download this app. It's set at ground level. So at ground level, as we saw before, we've shown 13 mile per hour with 23 mile per hour gusts. So let's go back in our threshold settings and let's just bump this up to 100 feet. We'll get there eventually. Okay, now at 100 feet, we've got 17 mile per hour sustained winds and 33 mile per hour gusts. So 100 feet is probably you know, about the minimum that you're going to fly. Go back into our settings, and again, uh, we're going to take the uh, wind altitude now up to 200 feet. Now we've got 20 mile per hour uh, sustained and gusts at 39 mile per hour. So we'll just continue on up, and we'll take. Now I've set the uh, altitude at 300 feet. So now we've got 22 mile per hour sustained, 43 mile per hour gusts. And again, we'll go in one more time and change it. We'll put our max altitude uh, that we're legally allowed to fly at, at 400 feet. So now we're seeing wind at 24 mile per hour sustained, 45 mile per hour gusts. So as you can see, you know, at 400 feet, we could be potentially flying into uh, 45 mile per hour gusts. Whereas if you don't change these settings uh, in your wind altitude, if you just leave it as it comes out as downloaded, you know, we're going to, you know, it, it's showing 23 mile per hour wind gusts at ground level. And, you know, you're almost, you're almost doubling your wind speed, which is 45 mile per hour. Uh, you know, is not a healthy uh, wind to fly in if you're if you're going to fly a drone. Make sure you go in there and set that at an altitude where you think you're going to be flying, because basically, as I said, you know this out of the box download it's going to be it's going to default to ground level, and uh, that could get you in trouble at altitude. So hope this helps someone and. Uh, Thanks everybody for watching. Thanks for all my subscribers and uh, hope you all have a good time flying and uh, we'll catch you in the next one.